for the last, I'll say at least 10 years, I've had a goal, written down goal, of failing at least once a day. And actually? Actually. Cool. I could show it to How'd you. How'd you fail today? Uh, I don't know. Um, yeah. I don't know. But, it, you know, it's just a general thing. Like, uh, I want to welcome failure as a learning tool. Yeah. Uh, you know, I don't enjoy failing. I don't think anybody does. Yeah. But the the more you know, I'm open to it. When failure does happen, uh, you know, it's just not as big of a deal. Uh, I'll say, you know, yesterday I was doing some work on my car, and I'm not at home. I'm on vacation. Uh, I had to replace the spark plug, and I got a spark plug. This was yesterday. This was yesterday. And you told me to start or, start two days ago. Yeah. Um, spark plug uh, socket. And I was in such a hurry at the store that I bought a half inch drive deep socket instead right. of a three eighths. So you couldn't so, fit it onto your socket. Right? So I, I went home because I had to reach over the engine to get the back three spark plugs. Yeah. And I, I, I need to let the engine cool. So I got the engine to completely <laughs> cool and then found this out. Uh, when in the store, I should have just plugged them all together and made sure they worked, you know, five seconds. Yeah. That's but easy... now I had to borrow, I had to, yeah, we were at somebody's house. So that's an easy lesson to extrapolate, right? Like, you know, right. And it doesn't have to be anything huge, but it did cause some inconvenience. And I was out there as the sun is going down, you know, it's getting darker and darker. Could have been there. 